Hello friend, in this video lecture, I am going to discuss what how to connect Microsoft SQL Server with Razor SQL. So first here, opening the Razor SQL, then you need to click uh, there, connect to database. Then after here, add connection, then you can get a list of the database this places. But uh, this video is about Microsoft SQL Server, selecting this option, then click on continue. Then you have different options to connect Microsoft SQL Server with Razor SQL. First is JDBC, then JDBC Legacy, then this one JT or Driver and JDBC this all you can get. First, I am using first option. So first here we need to give the connection profile name. So connection giving here SQL Server underscore com. Thereafter, you can connect with us SQL Server authentication. For this, you need to give the password and the uh, login. And uh, here, host uh, IP address, you need to give this all. So, for this one here, you can see if I disconnect and connect, then a uh, server name we need to give for uh, localhost and login that I'm going to connect with the SA account then this is connected okay and all uh, this is here Adam user created database this is the tables inside there now there after here uh, giving uh, SA and this place give the password then host or server name you can give uh, local host or IP address you can also give and port that giving uh, 1433 and database we already know Adam is the database so let's give here database name Adam now if I try to click uh, on the connect so this is connecting but it's uh, taking the times so here this is recommended port is 1433 but uh, here I am going to uh, this places so with the help of this query we can easily know what exactly is the port so when I run here the port number is 1433 1434 so just to uh, cancelling and uh, here let's give 1434 let's click on this connect now it's uh, connected so with the help of this query you can easily get the port number okay now thereafter it's connected then uh, you need to click on this database then here this is the HR schemas or table and this is here DBO schemas tables and if you want to see the records of the employees then you can get click on this view contents this place you can write uh, the queries so let's write here select a star from so this time going to select a list of tables that's come there let's uh, select here HR countries so when you uh, select this option here you need to click on this so here we need to run uh, this one okay so this is for continue build database and add new and uh, okay sql this is connection execute to now you can see this here if i click x click there then you can uh, get the output of work or country table okay and uh, this is how we can connect uh, Microsoft SQL Server with the Razor SQL. So I hope guys this video is the helpful for you. So now in this video it's over. So thanks for watching. See you next week. Thank you.